So one of the things I tell a lot of entrepreneurs when they're starting out, and this is definitely something that I teach inside of my programs, is what I like to call the freedom formula. See, so many people, when you ask them, what's your goal of starting a business or selling on Amazon or becoming an entrepreneur, everybody says one of two things, to make money or to quit my job, right? Or not work for someone else. Well, I challenge you to think a little bit deeper outside of that. If you currently have a job that you don't like, that you want to quit, and you wanna utilize entrepreneurship or your Amazon business as that catalyst that allows you to do so, I want you to think very specifically on how much money do you need and how much money do you need saved to comfortably quit your job or whatever your goal may be. So what I challenge you to do is to write down all of your expenses, right? What is your mortgage or your rent or your car note, your living expenses, how much you're spending on food? Write all of this stuff down and you can literally go and print your bank statement or your credit card statement or however you're paying for this stuff. You can print it out and you can circle stuff, highlight stuff and write an itemized list of what you need. I'm talking about can't live without, like utilities and a roof over your head, rent, um, stuff like that, right? Write that down, identify what that number is. I'm not talking about Starbucks and designer clothing and the popping bottle money and all this other stuff, but bare necessities. Once you identify how much that is, let's just say it's $3,000 to keep this simple, that's your freedom formula, okay? Your freedom formula is $3,000. You have to passively and you have to predictably be able to make that money every single month. That way you don't have to work or whatever you're doing for revenue right now, right? You can basically create this business that's gonna generate that income. So then what you do is you take the business and you reverse engineer what you have to do exactly to come up with that amount of money. So with Amazon, right, the slogan at the AMZ formula is you're only one product away because you can literally achieve that freedom formula with one product. I have and literally countless amounts of my students have. So let me give you an example. If you have one product that's selling 10 units per day at $10 profit, that's around $2,800 to $3,000 profit per month. Now remember, our freedom formula was $3,000. So very conservatively with one product, if we can do product research and find a product that meets that criteria, we've just completed our freedom formula. Now let's take it a step further. Once you create that freedom formula and you have your Amazon product up and running and it's generating that revenue, you can save some money and then get into real estate and you can start to stack different passive incomes and different incomes um, in reference to your freedom formula. So that's something that I did. I created the freedom formula with Amazon. I took the proceeds, rolled them into real estate, and I started to stack these freedom formulas. So what does that mean? That means if something happens to my Amazon business, guess what? All of my apartment buildings surpass that freedom formula. So I'm never gonna be out of money. I'm never gonna be out of cash flow. If something happens with one of them, the other one will pick up the slack. Now, a lot of you guys starting out, you're not gonna be able to launch your product make that amount of money, go to real estate, buy some real estate, so on and so forth. But I want you to see how I did this. That way you can have a master plan, right? My mentor said that in order to be prolific, you have to become specific. And I want you to become specific with your goals and set realistic expectations. So many people say, hey, I wanna make 100K a month, I wanna make 10K a month, but they don't microscopically break it down and they're not following step-by-step -step the milestones, the processes and the procedures needed to accomplish that goal or that freedom formula.